Hi, this is Jan Newton of Newton Custom Interiors, and today I'm going to show you how to hand sew a pillow closed using a ladder stitch. I've got my uh, needle threaded with red thread. I used red today so that you could see it better on the camera. And normally I would try to match the color of the pillow fabric. I put a big knot at the end so that it would not pull through the fabric. And the other thing I, that I've done to prepare for this is that on my machine, sewing machine, I stitched a black line 3 eighths of an inch away from the edge of the fabric. And normally I would also match the thread to the color of the pillow fabric, but so that you could see it better on the video, I did it in black. And what that does is I can hand press the, the uh, pillow fabric down about a half inch away from the edge and this black line gives me a good guideline as to where I'm going to want to fold that down and make my seam. Otherwise it's, it's hard to, to know what is a half inch away to make the seam. So we're going to get started here on the right side. I'm just going to bring my needle through now to start the ladder stitch I'm going to come across to the other side take a very small bite of fabric and pull through now I'm going to go directly across and take another small bite of fabric and pull through. Again, directly across, take a little bite of fabric, pull through. And you want to take small stitches. Um, it just looks a little bit better and closes the, the fabric together better if you take small stitches. More like a sewing machine would have done it. So you just continue on down the pillow, taking your little bites of fabric. Okay, now we're at the end of our pillow on the left side going to finish up with a couple more stitches and I did want to point out that I'm just going through the top that top ridge of the fabric when I take my stitch not going clear through both sides like this because that would show on the other side of the fabric I'm just getting that top ridge bring it on through and with the red thread you can kind of see the red stitches a little bit if you used a white it would not show at all but you can kind of see it makes a nice uh, closure for the pillow So I'm going to take one more stitch and then I'll show you how I knot at the end of the pillow so I'm going to take a little bit of fabric again, just like I was going to take another stitch. So I'm getting a little bite of fabric. I'm going to pull through, but instead of pulling completely through, I'm going to leave a little loop of thread. Put my needle through it. Pull that tight. And then I'm going to do it one more time. Stitch a fabric and then pull through so that there's a loop. Put my needle through and pull tight. And then to get rid of the knot or try and hide the knot a little bit in the end of the thread, I'm going to put my needle through the knot and then I come out further down the pillow. What that does is it pulls the knot in and then you just have a tail inside the pillow. 
So you just clip that off and then the knot is not, or the end of the thread is not sticking up out of the pillow.